Hey guys, this is AK Pro Films, and today we're going to show you how you can use okay. your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch to control your Mac or Windows PC. So why don't we dive right into this tutorial right now. So in order for you to take control of your Mac or PC on your phone, all you need to do is download Remote Mouse on the App Store. This is a free app, but can be upgraded so you can remove the ads and have more customizability. So all you have to do is download that piece of software, and you will have the ability to take control of your computer. So next what you'll have to do is download the other piece of software on your computer. So I'll show you how to do that right now. So now you'll want to download that piece of software for your Mac or PC. So you want to go to your internet browser, and you want to search up remotemouse.net. And here you go, here's their webpage. And if you're a Windows user, you click here and you download that software right from here. But if you're a Mac user, just ignore this and go to the Mac App Store and look up remote mouse and from here you want to click on here and go install that I already have that installed so I don't need to reinstall that so next now let's go over some basic features of the app so now let's show you some of the basic and more advanced features of remote mouse so first what you want to do is go over to your computer and find remote mouse and open that up and it'll appear up here at the status bar and you don't really need to adjust anything but you can adjust the options and view the help etc so next you want to make sure that your computer and your phone are connected to the same Wi-Fi network and then you want to open up remote mouse so what that will do is it'll have some options over here and you can just press start and it'll auto connect to that and you can buy the full version here if you really want to or just to use the program you can just press continue so down here there's a little button right here that you can press to hide the keyboard and have more space for using your mouse so I'm gonna stop using my other mouse and just use my phone so it's very easy just to navigate around here and it's pretty cool just uh, using your phone as a mouse so there's other options as well such as to play music you can see your dock here and you can launch different apps you can have the number pad for certain applications entering numbers and equations and a really cool feature is how you can shut down and sleep restart and log off of your computer as well so very handy features and you can adjust all of those very nicely you can tilt your device to come up with the landscape keyboard but this is requiring the full version so just rotate back and your keyboard will appear again so now let's open up notes so I can actually show you how this will work so it's a very nice way of doing this just hide your keyboard tilt back and there we go we expose the keyboard again so very nice input in way of data and all of that and you just want to make sure you are entering text so I'm just going to write different things here so it's just a very nice way of entering text you can also use voice dictation from your phone this is a test on a very cool app that comes in handy so it's a very nice way of inputting text. So that just completes our little review of this app. So it comes in very handy in different occasions such as entering text, scrolling through your computer, and just accessing different things in a very slick way. So thanks guys for watching this video on how to use your iPhone to navigate your Mac or PC. Please comment, rate, and subscribe, and ask questions if you have any. So thanks for watching this video. I hope you learned something new and check out all the other videos to come. Thanks for watching.